Grammar Lesson 6, Contractions. So we're going back to doing one lesson per day, so only one page of grammar work for today, and it's going to focus on contractions. Now, contractions are really just short forms that we use in English, where we take two words and we put them together to make them a little bit shorter. Okay, so a contraction is made from two words, and the general pattern that contractions follow is that we keep the first word the same. So we're going to take the words is not and make them into a contraction. Generally, the first word stays the same. Then certain letters are taken out of the second word. So in this case, the O is going to be taken out in order to make is not into a contraction. And it kind of just depends on the contraction for which letters are going to be taken out. It doesn't really follow any sort of rule, so it's something that you just kind of have to get used to doing and used to hearing as well. So we keep the first word the same, we take out a letter or letters from the second word, and then we also think you can think about taking away the space from in between those two words. Now, anytime you have removed letters, what we do is, in place of those letters, put in an apostrophe. Okay, so notice we have the word is, and then we took the word not, we took out the letter O, there's no more letter O, and replaced it with an apostrophe. And I have here a list for you of some very common contractions that follow that same pattern. So let's look at just the first one on the list. We won't go through all of them, that's too many. But if you take the words are not, we keep the first word, R, is the same, okay? Then we have taken out, let's see if, I don't know if I can do this accurately. Ooh, we've taken out the O, hopefully you can figure out, and we've replaced that O with an apostrophe, and then you just put those two words together, and then you have the contraction, aren't. Now, there's one contraction that I would like to point out to you. It is this one. This is the one that does not follow the pattern, okay? If we take the words will not and we want to make them into a, crack, a, a contraction, we don't say willn't, we say won't, okay? So that's just one that doesn't really follow the rules. It's, yeah, just an irregular or an exception to the rule. So just keep that one in the back of your head as one that doesn't follow those rules that we just talked about. Now for your lesson today, it would be handy if you kept this screen up, like you could pause the video and keep the screen up while you're working on lesson six, because what you'll be doing is you'll be taking contractions and breaking them apart into the two words that they originally came from, or taking two words and making them into contractions. And most of them should be on this list if it's one that you don't necessarily just know. So it'd be good to pause this video and just keep this up in case you need to double check in your lesson today. And that is it, a nice short one for today.